Good morning, good afternoon actually. Hello, welcome back to, I guess a vlog. It's kind of like a get ready for autumn with me. I'm off to, sorry I've got a mint in my mouth, <laughs> don't mind that. Um, I'm off to do a little bit of autumn shopping. And I'm also um, meeting, I feel like a long lost friend. Um, I hope I'm in focus. Emily Ball, once you guys probably know her. She is also, I don't like using the word influencer. <laughs> a content creator, <laughs> we'll say. Um, so yeah, I'm just waiting for her. Coming to my hometown. Very excited, I'm gonna do a bit of autumn shopping, have coffee, have catch up because as much as we've spoke for like the longest time, I've never actually met her, so. Yeah, and I'm also gonna buy a load of autumn house things, hopefully, not clothes, not clothes don't buy clothes um just autumn autumn bits for the house you know make a little bit more cozy so we are going to do that there's also a new tk maxx that has opened so, and it's two floors am i buzzing yes i am so yeah i hope you guys enjoy it's going to probably be like a bit of a shop with me a bit of a vlog chill cozy vibes get a coffee get a tea or get a pumpkin spice latte because guaranteed i will be buying one of those at some point today um, and yeah, enjoy the vlog. Look who I'm with. We are in b and having the time of our lives. Got a basket of cleaning stuff. Got some bedding. Ooh, I, do, so I am nice tempted. Oh yeah, here. open the bag. So, hang on, so I paid oh, yeah. how much? 14 pounds for that. Found this in Matalan, no price tag. So I was like, excuse me, how much is this? She couldn't find it, so I got it for six, six pounds. pounds. Do you know how fuming I am? Because that one is actually nicer, and I paid £14 for that one. Six pounds. Love. Like, fuming, to be fair, but you live and you learn. I am tempted. Cute. Like, I like this one. What, the brown one? Yeah. But is no, it, no, is it granny with the lace? No, I like it. But is it a duvet? Yeah, go on, pick it but up. It's not a... What size is it? I don't know what size duvet I've got. What does that mean? Oh. Is it a throw? Yeah. It Damn it. Yes, and all that stuff. Emma's got a shelf. <laughs> Emma and her shelf. <laughs> but this is a new TK Maxx. It's just opened. I am so excited. We have just come back from food shopping. A quick little food shop. Didn't need to get much because I'm not here for most of the week. I'm actually going down to see Tia because I feel like I actually haven't seen her in like a year. We talk every day, but. I haven't seen the girl in like a year, so I'm going down to see her um, and Jackie. Can't wait. Um, so yeah, we didn't need to get much, like two meals, and that was it. And the rest is pretty much snacks. So gonna pack this away, tidy the house. I used to clean the house. Like th no one cares about this, but I used to clean the house on a Thursday. But now I do it on like a Sunday morning. It's like it's just nice, you know, to have a nice tidy house on a Sunday. Um, and then I think I'm going to bake some cookies. I also need to show you guys what I bought yesterday because I spent more money than what I wanted to. And we just bought a lot of house bits. Um, so I'll show you guys that. But yeah, for now I'm going to um, swell the shopping. Like, we haven't got meals. Cause... No, I already said that. This just, this isn't looking good. <laughs> but <laughs> it's just snacks. We were lacking in the snack selection of the house. So we've got pom bears, got these, absolutely love these. Um, some flour, because I'm gonna make some cookies, some Weetabix, whatever that is. Some batteries for the scales, salmon, more snacks, pepper, coffee pods, brown sugar, normal sugar, chocolate for the cookies, milk, pancakes, milk, again, pak choy. Did I say butter? Butter. Uh, we got three. These were on a club card for like 85p. I swear they were pretty much half price. No, they, no, they usually what are they want, normally? Want There's a bee in the house, a wasp. Um, they're so good. The only thing I will say is that you just don't get much. Like, well, at least I don't think so anyway. Um, but yeah, if you like sticky rice, these are really, really good. So I've got three because they were 85p on club card. Some bread, wraps, more bread rice again <laughs> um parchment paper ham biscuits nuts crisps and crisps we literally got about 10 of the same things just in a different version 
Yeah, this is what happens when kids move out. A <laughs> uh, major house update that I haven't mentioned. Oh, my camera's about to run out. We got new sofas. <laughs> we just wanted bigger ones to fill the room. Um, they are from Danelle. The delivery and the turnaround was very quick, like literally five days. Um, we were just in Danelle getting bits for Dan's office and we saw them and I was like, I blooming love these. They're just a little bit, they just fill the room a little bit and matches the colour um, a little bit more. Yeah, <laughs> these sofas, they're so comfy. And this is like a proper three seater. Um, like I say, it's just a bit bigger and feel, it just fills the room up a little bit. So yeah, just didn't mention that. But here they are. Can you just tell how comfy they are? <laughs> I feel like last year, I mean, I think I did this video last year, something similar. And I feel like I didn't get a lot of autumn stuff. There seems to be a lot more autumn things in the shops. I don't know if it's because I'm doing it earlier. Because I feel like autumn stuff does sell out. And because it's for such a short period, it doesn't really get restocked. Um, <sighs> uh, uh, put it straight down, hates me. He hates me. <laughs> Bought way too much. Um, where do I even start? We'll start with Primark Home because I didn't get much from there. But um, I got this, which you're probably thinking that is so random. It was £4, but I thought, like, bit of garlic bread on there nice little serve like only little but like a little garlic baguette i just thought yep yeah, why not i'll take that this obviously i won't lie it's more decorative but it's like a little pine cone candle just thought it could look cute on the bookcase what is this i actually have bought like seven thousand different pumpkins probably shouldn't have done that I kind of just forgot, but we got this one, which will actually look really, really nice in here. It's like a greeny brown khaki. Next, this is an actual autumnal, but I just liked the look of it. Um, I literally bought a new soap, um, a new soap dispenser from Next, and the all the like labels come off it. The labels meant to be on there, um, so I don't know why I bought another one from Next. <laughs> when the other one was faulty but I just really liked this set so we have this mirror which I'm not sure if I'm going to put it in the bathroom or my dressing room um but yeah I mean it was 32 pounds very expensive it does like rotate just thought that was nice and then to match this is the toothbrush holder thing and there should be somewhere yeah just here a soap as well so lived all that and then I wanted one of these last year but I couldn't find one but I've got this one from there so a autumn Halloween doormat it says hey there pumpkin on it it's very big maybe it's more outdoor I didn't think this through I wanted it for inside oh this was from um, Tesco's it's the Mrs. Pink range and she's gone from like the grey and the silver to like Oops, the wood and I saw this and I thought it looked so nice on the dining room table they had a bigger version but it's just this little candle holder I'm gonna say and I can just get like a big wax candle to put in there and like I say just sat on the dining room table I thought that that could look really really nice um I don't know how much it was I think it's like 12 pounds just from Tesco's and then also is this Mrs Hinch I'm going to say that it is um, just a pumpkin, a nice little wooden pumpkin. Nice, I mean there's not any colour here, is there? I like the mirror. Oh, do you like it? It's for the bathroom. Mm. Well, it's obviously smaller than the one we've got. Then from TK Maxx, I got this washing machine stuff because our washing machine smells. Um, <laughs> And then, not seen this scent before, coconut and lime, a little bit summery. Nice. Also from TK Maxx. Oh, I'm a bit black. Okay. It's like autumnal though. Yeah, yeah. Okay. This orange, like pumpkin blanket. <laughs> yeah, it's not beige. Um, it's really warm, I think it's where it's been in my car. But yeah, I just thought that could look nice on the sofa. Okay. 
soft, isn't it? And I don't know how much it was, 25 quid, I want to say. This, which, do, am I going to light it? No, but yeah, I probably will. I don't want to, but... They don't want to smell when you burn them. They don't, but you smell, know. yeah, but I know, but smell how strong that is. Mm. Autumn ones and Christmas candles are always so much stronger. Um, bit of orange. And then also bought this to go on the wooden beam. It's just a cinnamon pumpkin little reed diffuser and it's orange as well. Any else from No. Oh, I've got down some, I've got down a Christmas present. <laughs> These little Ralph Lauren pajama bottoms. It's 24.99. I just thought they had quite a few. Um, just some good, a uh, good Christmas present. Not mugs. Got this to go in the living room just to fit. Like, I'm just going to bring a little bit of orange in here just for like autumn. Mm -hmm. You literally know what they say, sorry. Um, just nice, you know, a nice little, it's only three pounds from B&M, little orange wax melt. Okay, these are Christmas, but me and Em saw these and we both got them. Like, we couldn't, we could not resist. Oh, I, want this. I know, Jeez. it says hot chocolate and chill on them. Oh, <laughs> And they're just from being and they were £3.50 each. Um, they're really heavy, but like think a hot chocolate. I probably wouldn't be drinking a coffee out of this, yeah. I'd be bouncing off the walls, but for hot chocolate, nice. Oh, and got another wax now. <laughs> That's yeah. Christmas. Only because me and Embo said, come December, November, these will not, like they will be sold out. I feel like when it does come to Christmas stuff, like the good stuff you've got, I can't get now. And then just got this for the washing machine. For the washing. <laughs> We're still not done. More stuff from B&M. These are a pound. They're great. Um, this is great for the toilet. Scrub mommy because ours disappeared. Washing machine cleaner. Again. And this. Well, that's nice. I'm going to tell you the story about this. So there was loads of these ones. And then there was a really nice that's big awesome. matalan. Okay. Yeah, this is from Matalan, and there was a really one is still really really nice, but the other one was nice. So I was fuming. I think the bathroom bits look really really nice. So you see, there's the soap, the mirror, um, and the toothbrush holder. We already had this. This was from B and M, um, and I've just placed it on top. Here, I'm gonna make some cookies. I got my headphones on because the yeah, F one is on. <laughs> I can do football. I can do football, but F1, it's a no from me. It's loud. It's annoying. I'm actually going to shut this door as well. I'm going to dance out with some music and make some cookies. I've never made cookies before, not from scratch. Um, I used to love baking cakes when I was like a teenager. Not a teenager anymore, unfortunately. Um, so yeah, going to make some cookies. I'm just going to follow, I think it was Gemma Louise Miles. I saw her on Instagram do them. Um, and she does it with like actual chocolate rather than chocolate chips. I thought, what a great idea that is. So I picked up some Galaxy. And I'm just going to make some cookies. Uh oh, it was wet there. Um, and I had a great time, <laughs> basically. I'm going to put my headphones on and we can make some cookies. But let me tell you now, it's probably not going to work. But we're gonna try. I'm about to put them in the oven, but this is what they're looking like. They look like cookies, well, and baked cookies. They're they're huge. They're absolutely massive. Um, but yeah. I think I'd rather have like a few big ones than those are little ones that will just go stale. So no, they're huge. So this is what I've done. I've put the matalan pumpkin there. <laughs> I, never, I don't know if this is all a little bit too much. I need to sit on it for a little bit and see. Not physically sit on it, you know what I mean. Um, candles there. The glass jar is just there for now. Obviously when it's got a candle in it, I won't keep it there. And the pine cone is just there. That is what the bookcase is looking like. I'm running to the living room. I've got the new diffuser on the beam, um, which is, I just love the orange. And then I love the eucalyptus as well. That's from Danelle. Not new, but <laughs> just like the look of it. Then we've got a little pumpkin there. And then 
we have the orange diffuser, which has got a new wax melt in it, which smells incredible. Pampas grass, which again is always just there. And then the orange blanket's just there for now. It doesn't, sorry, Dan's just been sat on the sofa, it's a bit messy, but um, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna keep that there. Maybe I'll put it in the basket down there. But um, yeah, this is what we've done. <laughs> I don't think I ever showed you guys the kick is actually here. Oh, sorry. I didn't know I was. Oh my God, is it so chilly? I'm joking. <coughs> I didn't know I was a baker, but clearly I am. Look at those bad boys. Made them myself. But here is dinner. Yeah. <laughs> Just... uh. Salmon bites, sticky rice, and pak choy. Thank Sweet. you so much. Yum. Wow, you really cannot see me. There we go. Um, it gets dark so early now. And when it started happening, I was honestly so sad. I was like, oh, but there is something about today. It's just put me in a good mood because it just feels like a proper Sunday. I think it was baking those cookies, those elite cookies. They were, yeah, they were good. <laughs> I'm not gonna stop talking about them. I'm proud of them. I said it on my Instagram story. I'm a girl that physically cannot do anything. <laughs> um, Dan's one of these people that can do anything. Like, give him something, he can do it. It's so annoying. And I literally cannot do anything at school. Like, never sit out. There was nothing I could do. Maybe this is why I just film myself for a living because the skills is a big fat zero. The cozy kitchen is tidy, apart from the draining board. Um, there's just a water bottle on there. Um, but yeah, kitchen is nice and tidy. Here is nice and cosy. Put a light on, but then it won't look cosy. See, no, it just doesn't look cosy whatsoever, but I love it. New wax melt as well, which always makes me happy because you can always smell them. Obviously, you've been burning the same wax melt for like two, three months. You can, it's a good idea. Um, you can never smell them, but when you start burning a new one, it's great. But, um, I'm going to go jump in the shower in a little bit when Dan is done um, and have an early night because I want to get up early tomorrow, get this edited and then got a brow and lash appointment um, for a brow, lamb and a lash lift um, and yeah, get all my work done. Oh, I was meant to clean my car today, the inside. I'm taking my and granddad to the airport on Tuesday and I literally... <laughs> I'm one of these people, do you know what I have got better? I used to be so scared of driving. I don't know if anyone's the same, but like in mine and Don's relationship, he does all the driving purely because he has a nicer car. Okay, that is the excuse. He tells me that anyway, but let's be honest, he probably fears for my driving. It's, it's not that bad. It is not that bad. Um, and my mum was like, oh, like, can you just lift to the airport? And I was like, yeah, sure, sure thing. <sighs> Gotta put on my big girl pants and drive on a motorway no i will be fine but i do want to clean my car i'm fine driving by myself i don't know if anyone can relate but if i'm like i will drive if it's just me i will drive i can have amy and arlo in my car fine any of like anyone else any adult that's going to judge me no i think it's because amy and arlo both can't drive so they can't judge me um but any adult in my car just stresses me out <laughs> it's like being on my driving test again but yeah, I need to um, clean my car tomorrow. I swear to God, I've listened to so much music like the past... Oh, sorry. See ya. The past two weeks. <sighs> I just love music. Oh, we're back again. Um, do you know what really infuriates me? I'm just giving you like a list of random things that's going on in my life today, I swear. But singing. If you can sing, don't even get me started. Like, if I could do one thing in life, it would be to sing. I'm this close to buying a piano. I mean, not a grand piano. They're like 20 grand, but like an electric piano. Oh, I am so close. I did piano lessons from like year 9 till year 11. I can't remember how many grades I did, but I did a fair few. Now, off the top of my head, all I can remember to play is Adele, someone like you, but I want a piano. I just, I love music. You know, I love music. 
anyway, that is that. I'm going in the shower. Um, going in the shower and then, do you know what? I'm probably just going to get into bed. It's ten past nine. I'm a granny. What's new? And just chill and get up early on a Monday morning. Because that's what we love to do. That's what we love to do. Oh, I can't even do that thing. Oh, I'm coming. I am going to end this vlog here. I really hope you guys did enjoy it. I don't know what kind of footage I got. Um, but yeah. Either way, I really hope you guys did enjoy it. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you very soon for a, another video. Goodbye, guys.